The New York Anti-Trafficking Network is a group of people from a wide range of backgrounds and experiences who've come together to work on the problem of trafficking in persons. We have lawyers, we have advocates, social workers, and uh, folks who are just everyday activists who are involved. We meet monthly to talk about what trends we're seeing to identify um, and discuss new uh, policies and legislation that's coming down the pike and who our partners may be, what are the people we want to reach out to. This is really an opportunity for many different advocates that work on a variety of approaches, whether that's from an immigration perspective or a labor rights perspective, to really come together to think creatively about what clients actually say they need. One thing that really defines the network is that everyone involved has significant on-the-ground experience working on issues of human trafficking with survivors. This really makes the network unique. What we hear from our clients and from survivors that we work with is that actually things are really complicated. There's a lot of nuance here. And working with the New York Anti-Trafficking Network brings me to the table with a bunch of other organizations and activists who similarly appreciate that nuance and work to figure out how to act within that complexity. When I work with other members of the New York Anti-Trafficking Network, I feel more comfortable that my clients are well served holistically. The work we do for the New York Anti-Trafficking Network is none of us our full-time job. So it is more of a labor of love and it is something that is challenging for all of us to find the time, but we do and I think we do it really well. We uh, have a goal of preventing trafficking and ending it, making sure it doesn't happen in the first place, but also what's really important is to make sure that we're helping survivors reclaim their voices and reclaim their lives. Mm -hmm.